Hey, what's going on guys? Kelechi here and this is my unboxing and review of the new Infinix S5 Pro. I have the 6GB RAM variant with the 40 megapixel pop-up selfie. So when you open the box, you are greeted with the smartphone having some major specs labeled on the sticker. Next is the warranty leaflet. An envelope that houses the SIM ejector tool. The Infinix X Club card and the transparent drawback case. Next is a 10W charger brick, a micro USB cable. And the earphone. The design is fairly decent, having a glossy and glassy feel. This is a violet color option and it looks pretty fine. On the right side is the volume rocker and the power button. On the left side is the tray that contains Do 4G Nano SIM and the micro SD card. There is nothing at the top. At the bottom is a single firing speaker a micro usb port for charging and connectivity a microphone and a 3.5 mm headphone jack then at the back you have the camera bomb a triple camera combination of 48 megapixel a 2 megapixel depth sensor and the qvga camera there's a dual led flashlight the fingerprint scanner and infinix signatures on the front is a 6.53 inch ips panel 1080 by 2340 pixel resolution 403 ppi and 19.5 is to 9 aspect ratio there is no notch on the s5 pro it is a full hd plus display you can watch youtube videos up to 1080p nothing obstructs your viewing experience it has thin bezels at the top and bezels below are quite noticeable honestly the s5 pro is a big step up from the brand i commend infinix for stepping up its game in the budget segment the S5 Pro is big and bold, it is entirely plastic build and the quality is good. The finish is extremely reflective and will definitely draw attention. There is also the forest green color option. The pop-up selfie is a 40 megapixel lens. Infinix says the pop-up is designed to withstand 150,000 lifts, which translate to 50 circles each day for the next 8 years. It also automatically retracts when you accidentally drop the phone. And also do not try to manipulate or forcefully push down the pop-up camera. The picture quality of the 14 megapixel pop-up selfie is pretty decent. It has good contrast and high dynamic range is decent too. This is a 1080p at 30 frames per second video from the 14 megapixel selfie of the Infinix S5 Pro. What do you think of the sound quality and the picture quality? The S5 Pro comes with Helio P35 octa-core processor that is clocked at 2.3 GHz. It's a good budget processor that can handle your day-to-day -day task without lagging. Android version 10 with SOS 6.0 skin. You can also play games here with no lags. There is 6 GB of RAM and a big 128 GB internal storage. A 4000 mAh battery power that should take you a full day on a normal usage. It takes 3 hours to fully charge. There is no fast charge support here. The fingerprint unlock is not the fastest here, and also the face unlock feature can also unlock your device even in the dark. The sound quality is powered by DTS and I love how it sounds. What do you think of the sound quality from the S5 Pro? This phone is priced at $96,000 or $255. It is not cheap in any way. It handles multitasking with ease and does not resort to aggressive RAM management with up to 10 utility or social media apps running in the background. The main camera is a 48 megapixel lens with all the camera modes available except night mode. It does not support that feature. The images are delightful, it retains a good amount of details. Daylight shots look very fine and decent. One thing I love about the S5 Pro camera is that it does not overprocess its images and colors look natural with good contrast level. It shoots 1080p videos at 30 frames. The colors are punchy but it lacks image stabilization. So at this end, the S5 Pro has few things that makes it stand out. The notchless Full HD Plus display that has good viewing angles, good camera to satisfy your photography experience and a decent battery life. The S5 Pro is not the best phone out there, but it is certainly the best buy and also decent value for money. Thanks for watching guys and please drop a comment below and future comparisons you would like to see. 
and please subscribe to my channel if you're new and follow me on social media to see what I'm up to always. Thank you and I'll see you again. Peace.